Let's find the oxidation number for each element here in ZnCO3. This is zinc and this is carbonate. So we have zinc carbonate. So when we look at zinc carbonate, it doesn't have a negative or a positive. So it's a neutral compound. It's not an ion. And when we have a neutral compound, all the oxidation numbers, they add up to zero. So that's really helpful. There's a few things about this we should realize. If we have an ion, all the oxidation numbers, they add up to the charge on the ion. This is the carbonate ion right here. And it's helpful to memorize that the whole carbonate ion has an ionic charge of two minus. That means that all the elements here, their oxidation numbers, that adds up to minus two. Because we have that minus two for the whole carbonate ion here, zinc has to be plus two for this all to add up to zero. And for zinc, even though it's a transition metal, we're gonna see it most always as positive two. If you need to figure out the oxidation numbers for each element here in the carbonate, there's a link at the end of this video to show you how to do that. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.